Developing other sources of income can be a great way to diversify your earnings and increase your financial stability. In this video today, I will be sharing with you some steps that you can take to develop another stream of income. Number one, identify your skills and interests. You have to start by assessing your skills and interests and your expertise. That is the number one place you really have to start. Determine what you are good at or what you are passionate about as this can really help you to identify some income generating opportunities. I'm not the biggest fan of following your passion, but it's a starting point. That's where you really have to start. If you don't want to pursue your passion, then pursue something else that you can really use to generate an income. Which leads me to number two, research the different potential income streams out there. So here you have to do some research. Whether it aligns with your interests or not, research the various type of income earning opportunities or options that are available. Make sure you get as much information as possible about these ideas. So make sure you know all the pros and cons before you jump in and just say, hey, you wanna start making some money? A YouTuber said you can do this and make some money and then you just jump right into it the next day. Do the necessary due diligence, research, research, research. So get all the information before you get started. Most things will seem easy up front but it will take a ton of work. A few common options include starting a business, content creation, affiliate marketing, real estate, investing in stocks. So make sure you do the pros and cons and then you dive in. Know the requirements know what the returns are like, how long it will take to get to a million dollars, how much capital you'll require to start, all of those things. Make sure you research, research, research. So not because a YouTuber say you can make money from affiliate marketing, you can make $100 a day, $1,000 a day. Yes, you can, but however, maybe that's not the best thing suited for your skills and ability. Maybe it's better for you to go and start a physical business. Maybe it's better for you to start an online business. So research, get all the information together, and then you go in. Number three, really, 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 really important. Set clear goals on how much money you want to earn from this business or side hustle or whatever you want to call it. Make sure you have a clear goal set. So don't just say you want to make some money because when you start that business or that side hustle, it will be generating some money. So let's say the first month you do $100, right? Will that be the amount of money you want? So define clear goals and set exactly the amount that you want to achieve. Now the next step after that is that you're going to create a detailed plan. Now you may start without a plan and it's working but it's easier that you have a detailed plan outline of the step by step things that you need to do to achieve your goal. It makes the process way easier when you take this approach. So in this plan you're going to determine your resources, the time, your commitments, all of those things you're going to define them in your plan. Any possible roadblocks you're going to highlight them. You're not going to be able to pinpoint all of them because things will arise as you go along. So try identify as much as possible and have a mitigation plan around them. So in this plan you want to break down everything into small manageable steps so you're able to see and track progress when you're making them, right? Can you imagine recording an entire scene in your movie and did not hit the record button? That is what happened just now. So the next thing you need to do is acquire the skills and knowledge in areas that you, you are lacking, right? So if the income stream you have chosen requires some specialized knowledge, then guess what? You're going to invest the time and effort in acquiring those skills. Whether you're going to take an online course, go to a seminar, reading books, or taking on a mentor, you gotta acquire those skills. Work on your knowledge gaps and then go for that bag. Number six, number six, and this is the most important, take action. Like, I know that dopamine feeling sometimes when you get all excited and you're going to get the idea done, you're going to put in the work, but guess what? You don't get started. So you have to take action. This is the most important step. Take action, 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 action. You gotta take action. So you have to start implementing your action plan and take the necessary step towards developing that stream of income. This may involve setting up your website, networking with potential clients. It could be creating and marketing your products and services. This could be even taking an online course. Guys, a lot of excellent courses on Udemy. Great place you can start, right? So you gotta take some action like lights camera movie action you gotta take some action number seven track and monitor your progress regularly right so you have to keep track of what you're doing whenever you complete a task you keep track of it and this is where an excel sheet come in very handy 
right so you have to implement some of the corporate stuff in your life you know guys so you have to really track and monitor and assess whether your income stream is generating the desired result now we're not going to be negative here but you have to put it in the back of your head that everything is not going to go according to plan so you have to make adjustments and learn from your setbacks in the process so that's why it's very important that you monitor and track your progress so once you have established another stream of income successfully you have two options scale it or diversify i do recommend scale and then you diversify after scaling could be expanding your client base investing in more products or even investing in additional ventures number nine stay adaptable and open to other ventures the business landscape is always evolving so it's important that you stay open to opportunities and adaptable here you have to keep an eye open even when you're sleeping you can sleep with one eye and look through the other so do keep an eye open for emerging trends that aligns with your interests or your business and be willing to adapt accordingly to your approach now here's the thing that you have to remember and it's very important super important developing another stream of income takes time patience effort and consistency so it's essential that you stay committed focused and proactive in your pursuit of additional source of income so that's it for now guys thank you for watching and see you in the next video